。哎，各位同学好，欢迎来到 Phonics p o n i c 自然音标 ，Phonics p o n i c 自然音标的课程。今天老师要为你介绍的是 Vocabulary of the Day。Vocabulary of the day, 每日单字。而今天一样，老师要介绍两个单字 ，two vocabulary words for today。好的，那今天这两个单字是跟一个女的这个啊，我们讲的一个运动家有关啊。她不但是运动家，她还啊有一些其他的一些专长啊。那当然，她也创造了一些啊很多记录。Anyway， 那我们先来啊开始啊进入到我们今天的呃、啊、单字的介绍。Uh, let's start for the first vocabulary words、uh, for today. As the first word today is mountaineer, mountaineer, mountaineer. And second word today, Himalayans, Himalayans, Himalayans. Okay, if you can spell those two words, please do so. Ah,、uh, now I will repeat one more time so you can listen carefully. And let's go for the first word today: mountaineer, mountaineer, mountaineer. And second word today: Himalayans, Himalayans. Himalayans. Okay, now I will use spelling B scale, and I will give you more information and definition for those two vocabulary words. Let's go. Let's go over the first vocabulary of the day: mountaineer, mountaineer, mountaineer. Definition of mountaineer in English: It's a noun, a person who takes part in mountaineering. Example sentences: For the legendary mountaineer Sir Edmund Hillary, scaling mountain peaks no longer remains the sport it once was. The origins of mountaineer. Middle English from Old French, mountaineer, based on Latin mons, mount, mountain. And now I will repeat the definition again. Definition of mountaineer in English, noun, person who takes part in mountaineering. Example sentences for the legendary mountaineer Sir Emma Hillary. Scaring mountain peaks no longer remains the sport it once was. Origins of mountaineer. Middle English from Old French mountaineer, based on Latin mons, mount, mountain. Okay, let's go over to the second vocabulary words of the day: Himalayans, Himalayans. Himalayans. Definition of Himalayas in English: a vast mountain system in Southern Asia that extends for 1,500 miles (2,400 kilometers) from Kashmir is of Assam. The Himalayas consists of a series of parallel ranges, ranges that rise up from the Ganges River. Basin to the Tibetan Plateau. The backbone is the Great Himalayan Range, the highest mountain range in the world, with several peaks rising to over twenty-five twenty-five thousand feet, seven thousand seven hundred miles meter. No, seven thousand seven hundred meter. The highest being Mount Everest. The origins of Himalayans, from Sanskrit, from Sanskrit, Himalaya, from Hima, snow, Elaya, a boat. And now I will repeat the definition again 
for Himalayans. Definition of Himalayans in English: a vast mountain system in southern Asia that extends for 1,500 miles (2,400 kilometers) from Kashmir east of Assam. The Himalayans consist of a series of parallel ranges, ranges that rise up from the Ganges River basin to the Tibetan Plateau. The backbone is the Great Himalayans Range, the highest mountain range in the world, with several peaks rising to over twenty-five thousand feet (seven thousand seven hundred meter), the highest being Mount Everest. The origins of Himalayans from Sanskrit, Himal Himalaya from Hima snow, Alaya a boat. 好的，同学们，刚刚老师利用这个啊，这个 spelling bee 的这个方式来介绍这两个单字，所以我们现在再来介绍啊，再来再念一遍 mountaineer， mountaineer， definition mountaineer in, in English， noun， a person who takes part in mountaineering。Example sentences， for the legendary mountaineer Sir Edmund Hillary。Scale, scaling mountain peaks no longer remains the sport it once was. Origins: Middle English from Old French mountaineer, based on Latin mons mount mountain. Himalayas, Himalayas. Definition of Hila, Ma Hila, Himalayas in English. A vast mountain system in Southern Asia that extends for 1,500 miles (2,400 kilometers) from Kashmir east、uh, to Assam. The Himalayas consist of a series of parallel ranges that rise up from the Ganges River basin to the Tibetan Plateau. The backbone is the Great Himalayan. Range the highest mountain range in the world, with several peaks rising to over twenty-five thousand feet (seven thousand seven hundred meter), the highest being Mount Everest. Origins from Sanskrit, Himalaya from Hima snow, a layer, a boat. 好的，我们看今天这两个单字哈。当然，第一个单字 mount m o u n mountain 哈，那但 mountain 就是什么？就是山嘛，对不对？它是 mountain 后面加 e e r mountain n e a r 啊，所以在这个地方我们看它有双重音哈，重音在第一个音节，已经重音在第三个音节。好，那比较好玩的地方，我们看第一个音节，我们看它它的 onset 啊，它的 onset 是 m。啊，那我们看到它有两个两个 nucleus， 它的 nucleus O U 啊，它刚好这个 O 跟 U 组合起来哈，它变成一个什么？它变成一个啊，它变成一个 diphthong， 它变成 a u o o o m o u m o u n m o u n m o u n 那最后这个。A 哈，有个落母音哈 ，mountain mountain mountain 啊，那这注意哈，它的主重音在第三音节哈，所以这个地方它有个破音字哈，所以就给大家看它是一、e、没发音，一、e、又做降母音，所以它念短一、e、音啊，请注意它是一个念个短母音，但不是一、e、的短母音啊，它念 i 的短母音，所以我们称它是 variant 哈。啊，所以我们看它是 variant 哈，破音字哈 ，variant e as short vowels as short vowels i， 所以它念 e。好，所以我们看这个哈，再看一下 m o u n interpong t a i n interpong e e r。啊，次重音在第一音节，主重音在第三音节，所以第一个音节好，我们有个双元音。Diphthongs of, of, mom, 
mau mang mang a 念 a ten ten ten， 然后这时候我们哈，我们可以标一个三连音哈，一二。三，好，不要三连音哈，一一二，然后第一个做短母音，并且是破音，字念一，好，所以这时候你就看出三连音的，我们用三啊，自然音标三连音的标法哈，三个的时候通常都是第一个母音做降母音，也就是短母音，并且是 variant， 好，所以这个地方我们怎样啊？我们是一个双落音哈、啊，组合起来的一个双母音哈 m o u n t a i n e e r m o u n t a i n e e r Mountaineer. 好，那这个是 he, m, lay, yeah. 啊 ，Himalayas, Himalayas. 好，那这其实就是喜马拉雅山哈。喜马拉雅，我们台湾讲喜马拉雅山脉。好，所以重音我们看是一跟三音节哈，所以它总共有四个音节。所以第一个音节我们看它是 onset 啊，前音啊，首音 h 啊。啊，所以它的首音是 H， 它的第一个音节有 nucleus， 有母音 nucleus I， 在这个 i n t e r p o n 之前哈，我们看这个 i n t e r p o n 之前，在这个分音符号前，它有是做一个 close syllable 啊 ，close syllable， 好 ，close syllable， 好，所以这时候用 M 好，这个 consonant 好，这个 coda coda M 啊啊，去把这个做一个。封闭的动作哈，封闭之后就变成一个短母音哈。那 a 你落母音，所以我们先看第一个音节 him him 啊，就是这么来的哈。第三个音节又有重音的哈，又有重音，所以我们看啊，第三个音节的 onset 是 l 啊，是 l， 当然它有 nucleus 是 a， 不过注意看看，看到这个音节前。有没有注意看？它没有母，它没有子音的嘛，所以它这个叫做 open syllable， 啊 ，open syllable， 哈、啊，所以这时候就变成长母音了，啊，那这边再做个落母音 ，Himalayas， yes， Himalayas， 啊 ，yes， 啊，所以 Y 没有念了，好，所以我们再看一遍 ，Himalayas。好，所以你看，再来看哈，中音，啊，好，所以这样 ，he， he， m， 好，所以你看这个是什么？这个什么 ？close syllable 哈 ，close syllable 哈 ，close 哈 ，he m lay lay 好，所以这是什么？这边是怎样 ？open 啊，啊，这样在录母音 ，he m lay yes。啊，这是有声变啊，无声变有声啊，所以这样看起来你们就了解哈，什么叫做 close syllable， 什么叫做 open syllable 啊 ，close syllable 就是说在 i n t e r p o n 前啊有个子音啊，有个 consonant 啊，有个 consonant m 啊，做一个 block 的动作啊 ，block 住哈、啊，让母音没有办法直接碰到这个啊，这个这个 syllable 啊，这个 i n t e r p o n 但是 open 就不一样， open 这个 a 直接就碰到这个 i n t e r p o n 所以会做一个长母音。好，所以再来看一下 ，he m lay yes。好，好，所以再一遍 ，he m lay yes。好，如果用自然音标的方法，好，再来看一下老师，我们来看，好 ，mountaineer。Mountaineer, mountaineer, Himalayas, Himalayas, Himalayas. 好，我们看今天啊，到 Wikipedia 啊，如果对这篇文章有兴趣的，只要打 Fanny Bullock Workman, Fanny F A N Y Bullock B U A L O C K Workman W O R K M A N. 好，到 Wikipedia 打这个啊，人民就可以找到这篇文章。啊，所以我们来，啊，念到从这边哈，从 Fanny Bullock Workman 念到 Woman Suffrage。好，我来念一下 Fanny Bullock Workman， 1859-1925， was an American geographer, cartographer, explorer, 
travel writer and mountaineer, notably in the Himalayan. She was one of the first female professional mountaineers. She not only explored but also wrote about her adventures. She set several women's altitude altitude records, published eight travel books with her husband, and championed women's rights and women's suffrage. How was I? Yeah, she did. Fanny Bullock Workman, 1859-1925, was an American geographer, cartographer, explorer, travel writer, and mountaineer, notably in the Himalayan. She was one of the first female professional mountaineers. She not only explored but also wrote about her adventures. She set several women's altitude records, published eight travel books with her husband, and championed women's rights and women's suffrage. Okay, 以上就是今天的 vocabulary of the day. 好，同学们，如果可以愿意跟 David 老师做朋友的话，只要那 Google Plus 打 David T T I N G A D A， Google Plus David T T I N G A D A， 好，就可以跟老师做一个用 Google 来做积加，做个朋友，或者写 email David T T I N G A D A at gmail dot com， 好，当然就可以联络到老师，啊，可以跟老师讲一下啊，如果有些问题要发问的话，都可以用这种方法来跟老师联络哈。以上就是今天的 vocabulary of the day 每日单词，谢谢观赏。